My name is Khalil and I am here to answer your question How do we take the national talent search on AMP World? For this, we need to open the app AMP World and let's see that in the screen recording here. Okay, now let's open the app AMP World. Tap on it as usual. This is the home screen. And on the home screen, what we need to do is look at the National Talent Search 2022. First, look at your My Registration details. I have done several uh, registrations to demonstrate what we are going to do. What you can do is either copy the details for login purposes or you can take a screenshot and save that screenshot on your mobile. I have taken the screenshot, it will be saved and I will refer to it when I need to. Okay. So now I am ready to take the mock test. Tap on National Talent Search Examination again. Tap on Mock Question Papers. Notice that what I, the screenshot that I took was, let me go back. The screenshot that I took was this one. It was junior college. Of course, it has my name and mobile number. The exam login ID is given in the form of an email. And this is going to be your username when you log in. Below that is given the password, which we will use when we are asked for it. Below that is the exam paper link. The exam paper link will be used on the day of the exam. Today, we are going to do a mock test. So let's go here choose junior college and there are three links available <coughs> okay so to log in you can tap on link one let's see what it does and it will basically take you to the login uh, screen here it says sign in email or phone number remember the email that you want to use is the email that is provided to you in my case look at the exam login id it is ampjr one two two zero zero six six four at ampindia.org which is what I have to type here since I have copied it I can paste it obviously the paste will have okay it doesn't the paste the copying hasn't worked so I have to simply uh, copy type this in which was a n p j r one two I don't remember beyond that. Let's go back. Two hundred six six four. Two hundred six six four at AMP India dot O R G. Okay. And tap on next. It's going to ask for the password. Please notice that in your email there should be no leading or trading spaces. Sometimes when you copy and paste, <coughs> a space is introduced. Make sure that it's removed. Okay, what was the password? The password was a hash jc, right? So let's type that in. Capital A hash jc. If I remember correctly, let's not trust my memory. Go back, take a look at it. A H A zero three nine. When you do that, it should take you in. Now this gives you an option to stay signed in. If you want to stay signed in, just say yes, and you will be signed in all the time. Notice that what I get is your response has already been recorded. Okay, because I took this test once before, it is not going to allow you to take it multiple times. So go back. Let's look at another link. I took link 2 also so it will not work. Go to link 3 and then you are in the paper. Notice that this time it, not, it did not ask me to log in because I have already logged in once. Okay, now you can see that this is a timed response. Instructions are given on the top. So read all the instructions and when you are ready, click to start. Once you click to start, you will notice that a counter opens up, a start which shows 1 hour 29, uh, 30 minutes and now it is, I have consumed already 10 seconds. 
and here the instructions repeat please read them again and then enter your personal details to begin with so let me just quickly enter them notice here after khalil there is a space this happens a lot in your mobile app remove these spaces uh, in this case it's not an issue but in some cases especially for login it can be my college my contact number and then my email id finally next so now the instructions are shown one more time quickly glance through them notice that you have five sections with 20 questions in each section all are multiple choice questions with four options there is no negative marking therefore if you don't know the answer please make educated guesses below this you can say you are on page 2 of 8 which means you are going to go through uh, six more pages of questions the step on next and now you have the question section a is on data interpretation read the question carefully whatever is you decide is the answer to that in this case i'm just going to quickly choose random answers because i'm not taking the test i'm demonstrating how to take it so you can just keep doing that when you have completed it you will reach the bottom you will notice that the question numbers keep increasing you are we have taken almost 20 questions and there you go okay this page is completed tap on next similarly we show you the next section next page choose whatever the answers you think are unfortunately if you don't choose any answers it will not allow you to proceed forward you see the asterisk the red asterisk that says that it is compulsory for you to take the uh, to answer that question and every question is compulsory so you just have to keep going forward and in the demonstration this takes a lot of time unfortunately i have to go through that because that is how we are set up the question four pages done three more to go and we'll keep going forward i'm choosing b in all of them not because that's the correct answer but so that i can move really fast i'm not reading and answering these questions i'm just showing you how the process goes so you can quickly go through this one minute you can put it on fast forward because there isn't really much cover here except that i keep talking okay so two more sections and you are already aware of what these sections are so i'm not going to repeat them almost done this is the passage for the english comprehension part and next just one more section to go through and the exam will be complete trying to be as quick as i can okay we are done and finally hit on submit once you submit it's all over you will get a message which says that you have completed the exam and it will say a few other things about the exam at the bottom there are a few websites and our portals which you can explore and see to get additional information thank you very much good luck for the exam if you have any questions please do send it to us at nps@ampindia.org
جزاک اللہ خیر واخر الحمد للہ رب العالمین